<laughs> Good. <laughs> Sicily. So we will be on this for about 20 minutes. And there's our bus. Wow, this is beautiful. And let's see you in Sicily. We are officially in Sicily. in our elevator. I had to take the stairs. It's so cool. Very cool. Look at it. Inside. Alright, close the door so I can get by. Okay. Same building next door. Yeah, we had to stay here because we needed an extra night at the hotel that we originally made our reservation that did not have an extra night. So she got a hold of one of her friends who said, I'll put him up for the night. So it was just in a really, it was, it was nice, brand new, completely brand new. Inside yeah. was great, outside was a little sketchy. Yeah. As is this. So we have to go to the sixth floor. So we both have to take the elevator, so one at a time. I'll let her go first. Hey, babe, you go first. Always the guinea pig. If you make it, I'll try it. Sixth, okay. sixth floor. Right. See you in a few. Send the elevator back down. But it looked beautiful outside on the coast. We took a eight hour train ride and then we did a four hour bus ride from the port in Sicily to Palermo. So here we are and we're here for four days. Spent the first night in Claudia's beautiful Airbnb and now we're going to the next one. And here we are. Hello. Hello. Hi, Rosario. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you for the video. <laughs> Welcome yes, to Palarati. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, now this is crazy cool. Wow, lots going on. Very beautiful. Look at these old churches and the, the skyline is just so magnificent. And down there, we have market after market. Can't wait to get down there and see what's going on. We got music, I can smell the food. 
people walking around. Wow, this is amazing. Wow, this is crazy. It's kind of like an Arabic market. Lots of fruits and vegetables, and different meats and cheeses and restaurants. It's so unique. You just have to see this in person. So all these restaurants are open seating, it's really cool. The plates are like five, six, seven bucks. And you'll definitely get enough food, but man, it smells so good. Everything tasted good earlier, and we're about to sit down and have some more food. Join us. All right, so we're here at the market, trying all kinds of food. Some Nasina beer, which is the first port that we came into, or the first city that we came into when we got off the ferry. So, we're having some beer. And now we are eating. I don't know the name of it. Sorry. We'll get back to you. But everything's delicious. We got some squid. Yeah, the place is hopping. Every day from 9 to 3. It's just a big old party. Let's go. <laughs> Gotta have cheese. So we're having our pasta. First pasta in Sicily. Mm. That's good. Very sweet. But it's not as good as yours, Mom. Prego. Okay, here we are at the Cathedral of Palermo. We're going to go inside in a minute. The grounds are spectacular. Very cool.
Latino Mafia free museum. So look out for that. Yeah. So you can't visit Palermo, Sicily without learning a little bit about uh, the Mafia. And we just did that. Okay, you want to go in? Yeah, let's go. Okay, let's go. We're inside St. Cataldo Church in Sicily. It's very small, but wow. Just lots of detail and made from brick. It's beautiful. Hey everyone. So we are at the Santa Maria Church. It's actually closed right now. But we're just, yeah, walking around Palermo, checking things out. Um, it's kind of a cool, unique city. It's a little bit darker and uh, a little more chaotic than we expected. So our, uh, our Airbnb is kind of in the middle of an area that um, we were a little bit concerned about at first, but found out later. People are friendly and everything was good. Yeah, so when we, we, got, we came in late at night at about 10, anyways, we got help from a really nice man who actually led us to this door, this huge door you would not think is an entrance to a hotel. And uh, greeted by our um, Claudia, and she was wonderful, and we had a great stay. But yeah. she said it's completely safe to walk around the streets and everything, because right outside our doorstep, is the food market and it's huge huge anyway so the area would we stay in that area again I am not sure but it the people were very nice wonderful people so but other than that yeah we've been experiencing it. Mm -hmm. but yeah we've uh, we visited a few churches we've been to the water we went to a really cool uh, restaurant on the water last night with some music and uh, tomorrow I think we're gonna go to Mondello Beach and hang out for a little bit, enjoy some sunshine and mm -hmm. relax. Yeah, can't wait to go see some water and yeah. get inside some water. Hopefully, a little beach time. Thanks, Charles, for the for the fan. It really came in handy. <laughs> so yeah, we'll chat with you guys soon. All right. Just go. Just go.
Sicilian pizza. Oh, look at that. Wow, that looks so good. Hello. <laughs> All right, we're down in the little newer area of Palermo, a pedestrian street, and it's a little bit calmer. So, pretty cool. But yeah, it's beautiful. There's lots of restaurants, lots of shops, lots of people, lots of people watching. So, yeah. on that end is the ocean. Up here, you've got the mountains. One long string. Yeah, and where we're staying, it's a little bit more of a kind of an open market where our host at our Airbnb told us it's got um, kind of um, Arabic roots and how it's laid out for people to see and touch and point to and pick. So that's it. All right, we'll see you in a bit. Spaghetti Layla. Mm -hmm. Wow, that looks good. I got the same. Manja. All right, we found a cool bar. Pharmacia Alcoholica. Perfect. All right, wow, this is cool. Check this out. Super cool. Super cool. Well, hello. So they just gave us our menus. This is Viagra and some kind of antidepressant. Nice. <laughs> so what you do is you open it up and your menu is inside. <laughs> Came in a Viagra box. Since it's a pharmacia alcoholica, that makes sense. Okay, this is the view from our hotel at night. So pretty nice. It's very humid here. Good night, you all. Wow, that was fun. Hey, good morning everybody. So we are in Palermo, Sicily. And it's just been an amazing few days. We've been exploring the towns. Um, the food is amazing. The people are wonderful. They're very loud. And I now kind of understand <laughs> my mom a little bit better and my dad. They're a little bit louder than normal, but we love them and miss them. So here we are, we are at Mondello Beach, which is about 20 minutes northeast of downtown Palermo. 
and it's absolutely magnificent. I mean, it's one of the coolest beaches we've seen on our trip, if not the coolest. Um, it's completely packed today. People of Palermo definitely like their sun, but it's just an amazing. I'm about probably a hundred yards out, and the water is up to my stomach. So, water's beautiful, perfect, warm. But yeah, we're having a great time. And Terry's actually still up on the beach, chilling, getting a little sun. So the views are amazing over here. We've got the mountains on this side that are a little bit more covered. And then when you go through the beach to the other side, it's a little more rocky, but just unbelievably beautiful. The beaches, packed so the little places with umbrellas and chairs it's about $15 a person for the day but every single one of them were sold out so we just grabbed a spot on the sand we found a great spot right on the water it's awesome and we're having a blast but yeah Palermo is a very interesting city when we got here we felt a little bit you know uneasy because it was late at night first of all the streets are very unusual. Um, it feels so old. Uh, there's places where it's a little bit dirty and we had to walk through that area. But once we finally met up with somebody that was helpful, we felt much more comfortable. And of course our host at the Airbnb told us there is absolutely nothing to be worried about, that everybody here is safe and friendly and helpful and it's just really cool. So you'll see all of the videos of the markets. There's a market right downstairs from our hotel. It's really cool. The food, you walk down the street and of course you instantly get hungry. So needless to say, I'm in heaven with pizza at least once a day, pasta at least every other day, local dishes, great beer, and just an amazing, city of Sicily you're beautiful we love you and to all of my friends that are Sicilian if you haven't been here you need to get here and see how beautiful your grandparents and great-grandparents had it it's absolutely stunning so we'll see you guys later peace just go here we are Floating around the world. Get your shit together. Go travel. You can do it. That's right. View of the entire beach, mountain, marina, everything. Super cool. So this is the craziest thing I've ever seen. We are actually on a train and we're transferring to a ferry right now. So we are entering a boat on It's crazy. So we'll be on this ferry for about 30 minutes. When we get to the other side, we'll actually be on the mainland of Italy. I have never heard of such a thing. But we are on a train, on a boat. Wow, this is so cool. Did not know this technology existed.
So when we get to the other side, the ferry will connect right at the port to train tracks. And then from there, the train will leave and will actually split into two separate trains. One will go north and one will go south. Pretty cool. So we'll hopefully get a look from up above on top of the ferry, what the train looks like sitting on the ferry. This is crazy. All right, we are on. Okay, see you on top. Hey, let us know in the comments if you've ever done this. So this is what it looks like on the ferry. It's just a freaking train. It's just sitting inside of a ferry. It's crazy. Who knew? Here's another train being loaded onto this massive ferry. I mean, it's about 200 feet long. And then you go up the stairs. And you go up more stairs. And here you are on a ferry. Yeah, this ferry next to us is the same size. Check this thing out. We are leaving Messina, Sicily, and we'll be going to the toe of the boot in Italy. And it's about a 25 minute ferry ride, give or take. But Sicily was beautiful, we'll miss you. The people, the culture, the food, the landscape is beautiful. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You gotta get here. Bye, Cecily. We'll be back. Arrivederci. We loved it. We'll be back someday. What's been your favorite part of Italy so far? Um, it has to be the ocean, coastline, the beaches. Um, I love being in the water, so it being warm was perfect for me. And yeah, I think that was my favorite part. Hey everyone, so we're on a train from Palermo to Naples. Um, we did the train on the ferry on the water over to the mainland of Italy and so we started at around the toe of the boot and we're about an hour and a half north of there now but we get to look out for the next two hours three hours I mean there's beautiful beaches um, the ocean is spectacular uh, this is just an amazing view and it's just such a beautiful train ride because on this side we've got the ocean and on that side you've got more of the mountain uh, but these beaches are pretty cool and everywhere we've been in Italy on the coast I mean, it's just beach after beach after beach and they've got them all set up really nice they're clean they're beautiful um, and this is what they get to look at so this is our view for the day this is our view the whole entire
for sure, but this is such a great way to see the whole coastline and go through the towns and, and drop down to see, like, oh, we really want to come back here and uh, venture out. And Sicily was great, and the way you get off of the ferry and onto the mainland was really spectacular, and we did not expect that. 